What Quinn tried to explain, I'm Tim Morrison. Uh, we've been working on this operational plan. Who are you? My name's Tim Morrison. I'm a director in the ambulatory care team, working on the COVID vaccines with all these folks. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. And this is what a good representation of what we should be doing, the right thing. So our algorithm that uh, the ethicists and infectious disease experts worked on for weeks to use age, high-risk work environment, prevalence of positivity within job classes, a very complex algorithm, clearly didn't work, right? So there's problems with our algorithm. And with the best intention, which I appreciate don't matter today, that was the hope, that we were gonna move very quickly through people who were in those high-risk categories. It's about people at risk for dying, people at risk for transmitting the disease, and what we know about our population. We so, have families too! So we have problems with that algorithm, and as soon as we determine it, which only happened yesterday because we moved up our vaccinations by a full day, having oh, I'm not lying to you. Tim, Tim, it seems, that, it seems that the intentions have been very good, but there was a mistake and there was no resident representation. Yep. How True. do we prevent we this from happening absolutely. in the future? So in the future, you're right. Residents need to be pulled into everything. We missed that part. Things going way too fast. That's a problem. The solution we've arrived at really quickly in working with Dr. Katz Nelson and Ann Doan is how we make sure we, when, when this algorithmic list says, there's not enough residents here. This doesn't make sense to anybody. Algorithm stop. Foster algorithm. <laughs>